All right, here we are outside 736 Cedar Street. This is kind of the neighborhood. It's a one-way street. That's the way you come in right there. Um, back from the highway, it's kind of pretty quiet. You don't really hear too much road noise. And through here. All right, this was originally built in 1930. So you've got quite a bit of parking here over there. Um, it's about a 1700 square foot house. Check it out, you can see the lot line right there marked. Right up here. Alright, let's check it out. Here we go. Okay. So your typical kind of cabin look. Lots of little rooms. I mean the floor is cracked right there, so you know most likely likely this property is gonna go to someone that's gonna knock it down and start over, use the coverage. Um to build, you can max out at three stories. There is a strict level that you can't go higher to, or height, sorry, that you can't go higher than. Um, the bottom unit's roughly about 11, 1200 square foot. Just kind of keeps going on. Lots of natural light, just what you would expect in one of these old cabins. Nice stone fireplace. That'd be kind of neat if someone kept that. This goes back in through the kitchen. This is probably pantry area. Hold on, I need to touch. Got the backyard here. So if you can kind of build, you see the lake right through there, but you'd have to go up two or three floors to kind of maximize that lake view. Nice vaulted ceilings, the old cabin style. And then kind of a steep, Staircase here into another bedroom. <laughs> Got my little guy here. <laughs> Bath. This is the top of the vaulted ceiling. Water tank, furnace, storage. They just got this used as. Bedroom space kind of just keeps on going.